Hey, welcome back. We're going to look at how to order the correct parts on the MRP website. And if you're just looking for parts and you're a new dealer, you don't, you're not too familiar with the parts, some of the best things that we can offer are uh, the new items. Here on the left-hand side, there's a button that says new items. That's always getting constantly updating. We add three or four items a week. Uh, I'm sorry, three or four items a day, not three or four items a week. But uh, we have a ton of parts being added all the time, whether it's wheelie bars or items that you don't see anywhere else. Uh, for the ruckus, uh, there's a lot of different items. Um, the other way to become familiar with a lot of what we have is the web catalog. You click here where it says web catalog, and that's going to learn load. Um, and you got to click on this little book. This little book is going to lead to here. This is the web catalog. It has 150 pages of part numbers. Now, you can search it. I mean, you can type in here, let's say, CF Moto, and do a search in the search bar. It's a world to itself. It's a little book to, for those not familiar with MRP to read up on MRP or to read up on different parts. Now, you're going to see a lot of brands are no longer around, like Diamo, and it's going to feature a lot of Diamo parts up there. you got to let it load. And unfortunately, you know, Diamo not being around anymore, uh, some of these things might not apply. There's a lot of, like fly scooters here. They're not in business either. But Xenon, we have a lot of parts for Xenon. Since we acquired a lot of the OEM, there you go. You can see the part numbers. And using those part numbers, you can search for the parts back here on the MRP website. Or again, you can do an advanced search. We will be updating the search feature in the next few days. Uh, let's say GY6, or let's say type exhaust. All the exhausts will show up on the website. That's one way to search. And all the parts that have uh, our exhaust, part of the exhaust should show up. Um, whether it's a Vino or a Minarelli part, there's a lot of different parts here that, that will show up over 200 results and that result, the results page is going to be a lot better in the future. Now um, another way to search again is to look under categories. Parts by type is something I highly recommend. So if you have air filters that you're looking for or let's say brake pads or clutches, this is the best way to look for parts. So uh, think like a mechanic. If you need belts, click on belts, Kevlar belts. Should have over 100 Kevlar belts show up there. All the different belts that are in stock now, some pictures are going to be missing. You're going to see a little picture says image not available. We are constantly adding and updating pictures. Uh, we have now 17,000 part numbers, so we have a guy full time just adding pictures. And if there's a picture that's missing in your dealer, just email us and we will update that picture for you. We have more belts than anybody in the country for scooters, for small displacement go karts, ATVs, and they're in stock here. So you can see you can click on it and click on the belt, and it will tell you if it's out of stock, this item. Or if we go back, click on the next one, and it will tell you it's in stock. So it will stay there in green. And if you're a dealer, you can get the CSV file and see how many of them we have in stock. Uh, so the CSV file will tell you that, for example, this item, let me check. I'm showing there's 15 in stock. So if you get the live CSV file, you'll know that there's 15 of this gate spelt for the Honda Elite in stock. If you get the CSV file, you'll also see that this Aprilia Ditec belt was in zero. So Depending on, on the part that you're looking for, the CSV file as a dealer should help you out tremendously. Going back to that catalog, uh, the catalog will help in the sense that you can type in belts, for example, if you don't want to scroll through the belts. And you can go to the page that has all the belts, and it will tell you all the sections that have belts, but you might want to just scroll all the way down to the, to the end, to the belt section. We'll go over here, go to the at the very end here, and there's a page that just deals with nothing but belts and our best recommendation practices for the store. So here we go, this is the belts page. Let it load, shows you all the Melosi belts that we stock, all the MRP and Gates belts that we stock. It's right here, all the part numbers and their applications. You can grab this chart, it has the dimensions, the sizes on there, and it shows you how to measure the belts has all the Melosi part numbers that we stock. So the web catalog is really cool for a lot of these things. And a lot of these parts, if we don't have in one part, sometimes we have in two. Some of the Melosi parts have a corresponding Doppler or Polini part. Uh, there's just so many brands out there that even we can't stock it all. So uh, same thing for the camshaft. If we don't have it in MRP, we might have it in Scooter Ninja. We might have it in Doppler. We might have it in Polini. Some of these same measurements, same applications might be available in two or three different brands and two or three different price points. So make sure to check with us to see what it is you need and if we have it in stock. So going back to the manuals. Uh, we mentioned manuals earlier. That's here under repair manuals. 
when looking, for example, for a Malaguti yesterday uh, part, you're going to want to go and open the yesterday manual, scroll through this. These are some older repair manuals, and this is how you find parts for these uh, scooters, these older scooters. Um, so here we have an F10. Let's say the F10 disc brake, number 8. That's going to be 119398.00. So we're going to go back here. I'm going to type in 119398.00. And then you're going to hit go. Now that you have the part number, the Malaguti yesterday, which also works on the F10, see that? We were looking for an F10. But clearly here it says it works in the model you yesterday as well. Sometimes these parts will work in multiple applications. And this is how you order parts for the scooters that are on the website. Uh, in this case being a Malaguti F10 or yesterday, they use the same disc brake. That's OEM. We might also have this under racing disc brakes. You can click that and find the racing disc brake application from NG Disc Brakes from Spain. And in this case, we have several different wavy style disc brakes, and you can order those as well. So keep checking out. We're going to have several more uh, webinars on our site and, uh, pretty soon.